All right, welcome back. We're continuing to document this potty training journey. If you've been following along, I'm just here to continue to give my updates because I have another child that will be potty training and I know for a fact that I will be forgetting all of this. So this is helpful for me and I hope it's helpful for you. So I have seen less aggression as the weeks have progressed. I don't even know what week this is at this point. I've like lost track, but less aggression, but the tantrums still happen. They're not as bad as the other ones were so I guess he's starting to become more accustomed to the concept but we still are having tantrums despite the tantrums happening every single time he does sit down and he does go which is great um he now knows how to pull his pants down on his own and he will pull his diaper down on his own which he did not do before and he will sit by himself and he will go to the bathroom we have yet to catch a poop he is very strategic about the times that he poops it's typically in the middle of nap time or it'll be like he'll silently wake up from nap do it and then when i come in to get him he'll already be done so that's tricky we have to catch the poop on top of all that we no longer do the potty training watch that has been abandoned um he started reacting to it in a very negative way whenever i would put it on so we just got rid of that he's going every two hours still um, as far as reinforcers go he still has bubbles he still finds them very reinforcing if there's something else going on that he may want like let's say he wants to get back to a specific toy or get back to a tv show or whatever i'll ask him i'll say do you want bubbles or do you want xyz and he'll tell me which one he prefers so i don't force the reinforcer either whatever it is that is going to be most reinforcing or validating in that moment is what i allow for him to do so yeah that's my little quick update maybe it's not so quick i don't know <laughs> Not nice. You could say I'm mad. I'm mad. It's okay. You take a deep breath, go. Okay, so you're gonna need some help. You're gonna need some help because you have on a zipper. Yeah, you're passing gas. Say excuse me. Excuse me. You put your pee pee in? Wow, pee pee's going in the potty. All done? You're all done? I'm the pee pee in the potty. Okay, great job. Woo! See, that was fast. All right, then we'll be able to play again, okay? Okay. Do you want bubbles? Okay. Time for a bath. Woo! But first, hey, 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 we're not even on that step yet, buddy. But first, we have to. No. No. On. Oh yes, we are gonna turn it on. But first, we have to. Diaper down, buddy. Do you have to go potty? No. No, baby. No, not this time? Okay. Okay, let's go pee pee in the potty. Let's try again. Come on. Let's go pee pee in the potty. No. Try again. Pull your pants down. Let's go pee pee in the potty. Pull your pants down. Great! You almost got it. You almost got it. Perfect! Now pull your diaper down. Oh yeah! Good job. And you kicked off your diaper. Are you going pee pee in the potty? Wow! Okay, say I'm all done. Okay. Okay, it's time to go potty and then we'll have our smoothie. First punch and smoothie. It's okay. First we're gonna land. Oh, honey. Say I'm sad. Oh, 
It's all right. I all like you. It's okay. All right, come on, let's go potty together. Come on. Okay, you wanna walk by yourself. All right. Let's open the door. Great job, Mama will turn on the light. Perfect. What do we need to do? We need to party. That's right. Okay, can you pull your pants down? First pee pee in the potty, and then we're gonna mix the smoothie, okay? <laughs> you can do it. Great job. That's no it. Huh? That's okay. It is okay. You're doing a great job. First pee pee in the potty. And then we're going to mix and have our smoothie, okay? You're doing great, baby. <gasps> nice job. You're going pee pee in the potty. Good job. Are you all done? We're all done. Okay, let's put on a new diaper. Okay. Do you want bubbles or your smoothie? Yeah, smoothie. Okay. Do you have to go potty? <laughs> Not the case. Do you have to go potty? Okay. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A little slippery there, huh? Fresh off the tub. My only tips to myself, my future self, and to my viewers who are maybe about to potty train is let your child have the autonomy, of course. Like, they're the ones that are gonna be going by themselves eventually. So you kinda wanna let them have the leeway to like lead the process. If they say they're all done on the potty, do not force them to stay on the potty. Let them be done. If you're noticing like pushback, feedback, it, whether it be aggression or tantrums or tears, if it's not for the obvious reasons, like they're mad that they're getting interrupted from what they're doing, playing, watching TV, TV, whatever I would just kind of reevaluate the situation take a step back look at it from a fresh set of eyes that means that there's something that they're uncomfortable with and maybe they're just not ready so you want to make sure that you are flexible to meet your child's needs and not be so rigid on what it is that you feel your child should be doing throughout this potty training journey because every kid is different every kid has a different comfort level and at the end of the day you really can't force your kid to go potty like they have to want to do it so it benefits you to be encouraging and supportive opposed to rigid and like it's my way or no way at all because then it's just going to prolong the process my personal opinion but but yeah i'll catch you guys in the next little update and um thanks for watching